Eyal Benvenisti's project, Global Trust, rethinks the concept of sovereignty. To understand what sovereignty is, think of a person's home. In his home, one can make quite extravagant decisions, with no one allowed to interfere. Painting the kitchen pink, for instance. If the house is isolated, say it is a castle or a farmhouse, one could also throw loud parties that last all night. But if one lives in a crowded apartment building, throwing such parties is sure to get some very upset neighbors knocking on his door. We are used to thinking of a state sovereignty on the model of a castle. On this model, the citizens of the state make decisions through their representatives that impact their own lives, their rights, duties, property, and so on. But as Benvenisti argues, our exceedingly shrinking world has rather come to resemble one densely populated apartment building. Decisions made by sovereign states regularly impact not only their own citizens, but also citizens of other states, sometimes even very remote ones. This is true not only when the impact is direct, such as when a state builds a polluting factory on its border, but also where the impact is indirect, as when a country sets high bars for import. Those affect producers who may reside in faraway lands who depend on trade with that country. In this new reality, Benvenisti argues the ethical and legal responsibilities of a state are broader than its geographic territory. Naturally, a state is allowed, even expected, to give preference to the interests of its own citizens, but arguably it may not do so without considering the impact of its acts and decisions on others. Its liberty is not limitless, but comes with ethical and legal duties and responsibilities to humanity at large. It is humanity, after all, to which this planet belongs.